What's up guys, it's your boy Taco or Unbeaten and I have a team deathmatch gameplay for you today. I'm using the VMP with 5 attachments. I usually don't use the VMP but today I decided to give it a try and I do pretty decent with it. This guy got a lucky knife on me, that shouldn't have happened to be honest but... Anyways, today's topic is more so on the DLC coming out Tuesday. I just wanted to give my opinions on it and thoughts. So, I'm gonna start off with the first map, Berserk. It is a snowy map in the mountains. It seems like another snow map that nobody's gonna like, but I guess we'll have to wait and see how it'll be. Might be a large map, but Trek usually sticks to medium sized maps, so I kinda doubt it, but again, we'll have to wait and see. I, I really don't, in my personal opinion, I really don't like snow maps. They kind of always end up bad for me. I always end up skipping them or just like backing out of the lobby when I see them. But we'll see. Uh, the next map, Cryogen. For the picture, the picture for Cryogen makes it look really dope. But then we actually got some gameplay of it, and it doesn't seem that dope. Like it seems like it'd be dark and like kind of creepy, like a prison would be. But instead, it kind of looks like bright and not really that appealing. But I feel like that map will hold a lot of secrets in it, a lot of easter eggs, but we'll have to search around for that. But, uh, yeah. Cryogen, it doesn't seem like it'll be that better map. It seems like it's gonna be another, again, medium-sized map, not too large. Because Treyarch usually sticks to medium or small maps. The next map is Rumble, which is the one I'm most excited for because we fight in a robot battling area. And it looks like it'll have some great sights and lines to kill seems like it'd be like a more bigger map than the other ones though so i feel like it might be a large map i guess we'll have to wait and see might end up being my new favorite map for the dlc the next map is empire and that's just a remake from black ops 2 raid everyone loved raid but i didn't really like raid that much i don't know maybe it was just a head glitching that really pissed me off but we'll have to wait and see I think it's probably going to play the same way as Black Ops 2, but it might be a little, dif a little different now that we can fly up and stuff. Right there you saw I just got a super kill, I was popping off on these kids. Pulled out my purifier, nobody seems to be at the top, but hopefully I can get my kill streaks with it. Anyways, the last DLC map is Zombies for Grorod Krovi or City of Blood. Not sure I pronounced it right or not, but yeah, that's how usually everyone pronounces it. I'm probably most excited for this and that will be the first thing uploaded on my channel when the DLC comes out because that's what I'll be playing the most. I will get game four separate gameplays of the, all the other new maps. Hopefully they'll release a, a separate per, player list for it so it wouldn't be so hard to get them and just like uh, the freaking regular ones, the regular game modes or whatever. But yeah. Design maps look like it's gonna be the best one. It has the PPSH and what seems to be the Mark Threes and all kinds of you can ride dragons. It seems like it's gonna hold a lot of secrets to the Easter egg. Can't wait to see how what they're gonna do and how they're gonna take it. I've been very fond of zombies, been playing it since World at War and been keeping up with the storyline very much. So it might be the the new best zombie map. We'll have to wait and see. This DLC looks like a, a lot more appealing than the other two did. I don't know, for me, DLC 2 and DLC 1, I didn't really get that hype, but DLC 3, I'm pretty hyped. I mean, DLC 4 might be better than DLC 3, so we'll have to wait and see. Again, for me, Origins was like 10 times better than Buried, so I have hope for Treyarch. Have faith in Treyarch. Right there, my talent got the kill for me because I was choking hard. But I'm pretty much leading team, like, I don't know, I think I'm leading team. I mean, I got 32 kills and they have 16, 12, 10, and 5, so I'm pretty much leading the team here. Otherwise, they'd be keeping up with us and it'd be like a fair match, but my killstreaks are just smacking them around, so it's 84, 52. Probably no chance for a comeback. Uh, so Treyarch moved their live stream to tomorrow at 2 p.m. for Eastern and 11 a.m. for Pacific, so... I will upload another gameplay tomorrow and have information on the multiplayer maps and whatever they decide to show for zombies. But, uh, so yeah, so stay tuned and subscribe to my channel to see gameplay of the new DLCs and more information on the upcoming Call of Duties and all. 
That jazz. This gameplay is coming up to an end. I used my purifier, you know. I had to be the clutch one to get the last kill. So, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna let it play out. Your boy Taco out.